This is Jason with Coptoon Studios, and we're showing you our new game, Condor. We're going in right now, and we changed uh, some graphical settings on this thing. So if you have the older version of the phone, you can set it to low, high, um, ultra, just depending on whether you have a iPad, an Android phone, so on and so forth. Um, we actually went in and made sure that when we did the campaign, any of the survival modes or anything like that, that you were able to keep your scores so you can go in and compare and contrast all your friends and cohorts. Um, we menu, we thought we'd go in and, and make it make it to where you can just change it whatever colors you like, and, and we thought that would be a kind of a cool thing. So. Um, you know, text colors, menu colors, so on and so forth. Okay, and then game mode. So we have we have three different. You're going too fast, Matt. You're killing me, dude. We have three different, uh, four actually four different game modes. You have your campaign where we went in and tells a little bit of story about um, the pilot and uh, what you're trying to do, so on and so forth. Then we got survival mode, uh, and it's kind of the best score wins. Um, time trial, what is that? Is that with the rings? And then uh, we've got the endurance where you have a timed timed rings, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, so anyway, Matt's going to go ahead and go through and show you some of the uh, levels that we have. Uh, we have, what is that? Two, four, six, shoot. You know, I, so, I know my game so much. <laughs> we have six different planes that you can choose from. Um, if you do the free version, the free version only has what, two, three, two, two planes? Um, the first two that you have right there. Uh, so let's pick, let's pick that one right there, Matt. Let's do that. So you can swipe it left and right and it will show you, um, kind of what you guys, your objectives of everything is. And, uh, then you just push play. Um... This one's kind of cool because we did some particle systems. We wanted to be able to fly through clouds. Now, granted, it's very hard to try to to make a constant cloud cover and everything else with a phone, but we did the best we could on this bad boy. Um, all right, Matt, why don't you swoop down and, and land on that? Aircraft carrier. FYI, I'm probably not supposed to tell you guys this, but if you actually take your boost, not your boost, but you take your throttle down about halfway, you'll probably survive most of your air fights better. <laughs> nice job, Matt. Oh, Matt. Okay, so now let's go into... Uh, Matt's going to show you two more levels, go through them really quick, um, just so you can kind of get an idea of what all the sky boxes look like and, and kind of the feel of, of some of the stuff on the paid version compared to the free version. Alright, now let's show the next one. That's my favorite plane. So this one you're supposed to carry, what is it, you're supposed to protect your, your uh, carrier or something like air that. Air convoy. Air, air convoy, there you, thank you. Um, we just want to kind of give you a, a look at... Uh, how the desert scene looked like. Getting close to that bad boy.
All right, let's go to uh, survival mode. Oh, that's cool. Keep on going, keep on going. Crash into him. Uh, <laughs> nice. All right, so now we're going to go into the, uh, the bonus. We decided we uh, were going to put a lot of bonus levels to the paid version, just kind of a thanks for all the people who who supported uh, Cartoon Studios. So we came up with endurance and time trial and survival modes. And what are we doing? Time travel? Time trial? Yes. Okay. Time trial is where you basically go in and you have to go through these rings as fast as you can and you have a certain amount of time. If you can't get through them fast enough, you lose life or time, right? Time? <coughs> Actually, it's uh, no time limit on here. Oh, okay. Just how, however fast you can go through all of these. I'm thinking of the last one, aren't I? Yeah, that's endurance. Okay. Well, you got a ring up on top, don't you? Well, that was evil of him to do. <laughs> Now we're going to show you my favorite, the cityscape. I think that's seven, isn't it, Matt? Six or seven? Six. So, I forgot how fast this one moves. You're getting pretty good this one, Matt. Matt, my lead programmer, is doing the uh, driving because I uh, I can think of this stuff, but I can't drive it over the crap. So a little too fast. Uh, okay, so what basically what I want to also touch base on is the control settings. I've had a couple people go in and. Um, we had the classic control and we had the, the new controls. The classic controls is what basically what the game loads with. A lot of the uh, um, a lot of our people, it was kind of a catch-22. We had a lot of people who liked the old version and, couldn't, and then people who couldn't play it. So what we did is we did an, a newer version that has a little bit of a touchier, you don't have to move your phone as much. So when you play the game, please make sure that if you want to try the new settings, make sure you you go in and you do the uh, um, what is it the um, the calibrate it. Just make sure you calibrate it. Hold it to where the phone where you want that phone set to where you're comfortable with it, and it will automatically lock you in. Now, if you do not like the new controls, please make sure you go in and change those and calibrate it the same way, and it will work with the old controls. If it's not working to where you like it, just go ahead and shut it down, restart it, and it should go back to the to the general settings that it was first installed with. Anything else you can think of, Matt? I uh, just want to point out the big difference between the high and the low quality settings. Um, as you can see, you can see the island from here. If I put this on very low, we cut the camera way far back, so it will uh, reduce the amount of processing that your device has to do. And uh, we have several uh, cal several uh, things we, we display on the screen. We've got a compass, so it, you can know where you're heading, and then your speed. Here's your throttle bar, and um, some important features that you need to know to land. You need to get your speed real far down. Once it turns orange, you'll start dropping 
and to uh, go to the next level you have to go red in the speed. See now I'm dropping down. You don't have to be exact. Oh, and I missed it. But that's about it. Well, thank you all for supporting Cartoon Studios. Uh, please look for Covert Ops. It's on the Android market and on all the Apple iTouches, iPads, so on and so forth. Um, we are getting ourselves into a contest, and come support us. We'd appreciate it. Thank you.